What's up guys, Steve again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24-7. Quick video, check this out. Now this takes a little bit to put together because it comes at a kit, but this is a base, and this is like a, a solid milled piece of aluminium. It's heavy as, which is awesome, because this is for the Toyan V8 FS, or V800, I, you could call it, and it's incredible. Um, so you get two versions. There is a basic kit or standard version, which is just a basic uh, kind of stand with a push button. And you have his advanced kit. It's got like a little, um, I think it's a temp gauge, something like that there. There you go, check out that. How awesome is that? They've got a water tank and your fuel tank. Um, anything you need to supply yourself, I believe, is the cooling system like the radiator. But there we go. So it's got everything you need and you put it all together. Um, it's basically just this here, and I haven't um, put it together, obviously, but I just wanted to show you quickly. Yeah, check out that. But I got the box in, I thought, oh, wow, what's this? And it's a stand, but like I said, this thing weighs a fair bit. I'm not too sure exactly, but definitely a few kilo, and it's all, you know, CNC. Check out that. So quickly go through the box and show you what you get. So here's one of your tanks. And then, like I said, these are all aluminium and it's see-through at one end sweet also get another one here and this will be for the uh, cooling system and you know, like i said before you just need a supply radiator there you go that awesome what else we have in here a lot of brackets and you're like a little screen i believe um, there you go there's a little led screen there there's two of them so Interesting stuff. Um, these are other things here I've got for my V8. What else do we have in this box? Cool little uh, light there, so it must be when it's on or when you're about to start it, it flashes. Some more components. You have some uh, fuel tubing there, which is always good. Little brackets. Uh, you've got your motor mounts in there as well. Just here. There you go, there's very nice CNC aluminium blocks as well. Awesome stuff. On and off switch, it's even got a key. So it's got a key start there, push button now. There's no um, red and green lights. Now there's no instruction manual per se in this. So like I said, I didn't want to do a video of me putting it together because hey, I'm learning as well. So it's got to go off reference pictures on the internet. Um, and then we'll see how we go. But yeah, I just wanted to show you that as well. Got a few more things from Sterling Kit. A couple more bases as well here. I believe that's for the uh, that uh, budget-friendly two-cylinder that you put together. So I'll find the links and I'll put them all down below. But I thought you guys would be interested quickly. Just wanted to show you that. So yeah, that looks awesome. Check out that. How good does that look? Amazing, eh? And like I said, if you just want a standard version, there we go there. So it comes with the base, the key, starter system, and that's the advanced version there. So big difference in price, 400 bucks compared to 250, but uh, currently got a 10% off code with that CP10. But uh, there we go, guys. All right, quick video. Just wanted to show you all that. I thought it was pretty cool. And hopefully I'll get this, uh, this all sorted and see where everything goes. Because sometimes it does get a little bit difficult um, when there's no instruction manual, but that's the part of the hobby. Try. Put things together. All right, guys, have a good one. Catch you around.